You don't like it when people tickle your armpits, but do you like it when they stab your armpits? Grumble! What's up? And I see we got Sam and Ruth, welcome, and Mike and Dukeman and Monty, and welcome all. No stabby armpit. I hope you all had a happy Easter. As much as you can. It takes so long to load up for you. I had to go out. I was. I took longer because uh, Tate. I was getting water, and then Tate was like, "Excuse me, I would like to go outside, please." Right this second, I have to close my. Uh oh. Armpits or knee pits? For tickling? Or like for stabbing? Because. <laughs> but like for. for si It's for science for what? I need to know what is happening to the armpit or the knee pit that I'm choosing from. Because I feel like. <laughs> But I feel like if I had to choose to have one stab, it would be the knee pit. Because I I feel like if my arm pits were stabbed, it would disable like my arm. And I use my arms a lot for like everything that I do. So I would rather have my knee, specifically my left knee, because I can still drive if my left knee is my left leg doesn't work. It would hurt more, but I could uh, likely not have as much wrong with me. Because, like, if my arm pit was stabbed, I might not be able to draw, I might not be able to use my right hand my arm at all. Oh, the arm pit would have hurt more. That's what I heard. The machine's quick. <laughs> Get a robo knee, you can do that too. I mean, getting stabbed would hurt. Let's see. Uh, uh, okay, we're heading to the ruins, you guys. It's it's time for a cool out. <sighs> hopefully, hopefully, I'm going the correct direction. David, what's up? I love that you always enter with the cat. I not go in the correct direction? I must have, right? This does not look right. This is a different ruin, isn't it? Anyway, I love that you always enter with the Marcella and the cat in the box. <laughs> Mike is still thinking about that goose. Did you tell the class what you- that has to be the correct word. Did you tell the class what you did to the goose? Did I confuse myself? Was that- was that actually the correct ruin or was it the wrong ruin? Monty, I need your expertise. like a party.
I feel like previously when I dropped into the ruins, I hit a bunch of water immediately, and this feels like the place where I went in as a child. <sighs> I never had issues finding the one place, and now I am. Happened while you were in Florida? Well, at least... I don't know if that's better or not, but at least you weren't... Pretty sure this was the one because I've been to it like multiple times now. But instead, it's like. Oh my gosh. I thought I was gonna be profesh about this, the bunker. Oh, that's why. Because, yeah. It's the bunker, it's not the ruins. Can't carry more. Okay, well, we'll do this one more time, it's fine. <laughs> this isn't the one, I'm pretty sure this, the ruins is the one that I fell in as a child, because All Mother is right there. Okay, let's try the bunker. Yeah, somehow I confused myself. Thank you. Hey, buddy. But I know that it just kind of drops you into water once you go in, so I was pretty sure once I got in there that I was like... Fall in. Okay, we hit water. We should be good for real now. We can't stop trying turtlenecks. That's all Malik wears. He is a modest boy. Malik. I should say Malik. To differentiate from Malik and Malik. <laughs> We got it, homies. Those clamps have the armor locked in place. Maybe there's a way to power up and the mechanism. And they're spread he's spreading the modesty to the entire location. Throat coats. Uh-oh. It's Bob. No one quits. Everyone writes. If you don't... If, if don't, I'll edit you myself. Okay. Fair. Fair. <laughs> there we go. Oh, hey, Bob. Two. I am currently looking Just at what my more. next project is going to be, and also I have to do another round of edits on it. There we go. Another, I should say another one. read through of Body More Zero. All powered up. Now to get the dials in position. Oh, the dials. There must be some there. kind of code. numbers. They must be related to segments of a circle. Oh no. Is that 90? <laughs> 90 this way and 270 that way? No! The frick is 630! Carry and comfort, which is why, that, which is why is that book so long? It's true. 
Hey, I was thinking of doing Boom Shakalaka Boom next. <laughs> but we need more hexes. In the world. Oh no, what's 450? Oh no. Nope. <laughs> it's okay. We can be the exact same way, Monty. Do it. Did it. Hey! Let's have a look at that armor inside. Heck yeah! All right. Now let's see what we can do with this material. <laughs> I need those things. <laughs> but the thing is, I don't want to disparage myself. But the thing is... You know, I disparage myself all the time. I don't know why this is going <laughs> I think the body more one is the weakest of all of them. And that's because I knew better what I was doing after body more <laughs> one. <laughs> Though some people like it better than body more two because body more two has more emotionality in it, as they say. Oh, there's a Selly guy over here. Heck yeah, Glowy. Never know when I'm Not that I'm these. saying one is bad. It's just I think the other ones get- I think it gets stronger. I think the body more just gets stronger the further into the story you go. But other people will have to tell me. Because I am, of course, biased. any of them are bad. I just think that it builds... I just think that I build the lore effectively as the story goes on, so I guess there's my other bias, so I'm not just disparaging myself. I need you all to give yourself a clap on the back for your hard work. Oh, control is on the list, bro. I was gonna, that's not been on my Steam list anyway, and so I will just add it to the Sunday night choices. So we've got, what we need is Rockstar to make Red Dead 1 for computer, but so far we've got No More Heroes 3, then Ragnarok, then Horizon Forbidden West, then Control. And then Red Dead Redemption will be dropped in there, where if it is ever released on PC. 
start, please. And there we go. We got options. We got it laid out. Bob, you have you've done your job. It's probably your favorite subjectively because of Jan. I hope you're uh, ready for... <laughs> there was... I was thinking my video on Thursday is going to talk about it because I was talking about art. And I'm really thinking of doing Boom Shakalaka next. Because it'll just be fun. <laughs> Especially with Scarlett Johansson throwing herself... <laughs> Throwing yourself that young. Something's yeah. grown too soft. Oh, no. Too much Osram influence in the palace. When the CIA is throwing its assets at you, literally. No shadows under the noonday sun. They don't even know what to do with me. I'm so cool looking. Do we need to do? Do we need to do Frozen before the end of the game? Okay. I didn't know if we needed to finish the end of the game before. Then we can go and do that. Or I would have made that mistake, so thank you. <laughs> okay. Tatum, thank you. Appreciate you. Thank you. Also, I'm glad that you like Boom. I don't think Boom like anybody cares about Boom. Poor Jan. But I appreciate that you do, Ruth. Tatum is giving advice. Glad you like Yon too. Bam. And uh if uh if you get the sub boom figuratively happen later in the future, do not blame me. I should say of Shakalaka. Hey guys, what's up? Welcome. How are you doing today? How was your Easter? What are you doing, Eloy? This path leads to the cut. The Banuk have nothing to offer besides useless mysticism. The Eclipse won't stand idle while you waste time playing in the snow. Return to your desk. Mysticism. Surprised you're still checking up on me. I thought you had moved on. Well, forgive me for still being concerned with the fate of the world. I was thinking, Banuk shamans thread blue cables through their Those skin, cool right? Lights. Kind of like someone else we know, huh? So maybe the real reason you want me to stay clear of the Banuk is to stay clear of your past. It's not the past that concerns me, Eloy. It's the future, or possible uh... lack thereof. Which is why you should stop prattling and get uh... back to what matters. But as usual, uh... you'll do as you wish. Mm. Touchy. I wish I was this strong. Oh my god. Let's play Go back for blood with Sam. The firefighter chick is so buff. She will take your mask. No space. This one's a new predator. I can see the heat coming off it. The problem is also Irish.
before I even breathe out. Oh, yeah, it's really cold. <laughs> I feel like we escaped the cold a lot. I'm enjoying this game a lot. The gameplay is fun. I think the story is great. I think this is also peak YA writing. Like, this is what YA writing should strive to be. Hostiles. Ha! You sure you'll be warm enough up here, Nora? I've worked up a sweat from the climb. They will be accidentally. This is you made the DLC. It to the cut, Outlander. Not that you'll stay long. Monty suggested the doing the DLC before the ending of the game. Ready for a rare sight, Nora. Uh oh. Bergrind, purveyor of necessities. Most of the time, the Banuk burn their dead, but not today. Because the bodies couldn't be recovered. Aye, a nasty business. All their best warriors lost. So they're getting a different kind of send out. like our new hair piece. your grief, my hunters, and kill it! For our kin seize the fate all Banuk long for, falling with their spears striking steel. Their struggle is over now. You have witnessed their spirits rise up into the blue sky and beyond to the blue light. But our struggle is only beginning. Soon, we will again take up the hunt against the daemon that frenzies the machines against us. 
And so I ask you, can you summon the courage of our fallen kin? Will you fight and die as well as they did? My courage! My spear! It's a perfectly magnet. It's got a magnet. Our blood is in your teeth, Oratok! We are Banuk. Our enemies. Our prey. The daemon. That frenzies the machines. Machines that wiped out their best. And what do they want to do? Go back up there. Fools. A little advice. Uh, for free. Uh... Aloy. Aloy. I've been up here Flex for too long, Wontis, and I still can't make sense of the Banuk. Take this ruckus. It started with one of their shamans, uh, Orea. Spouting on about spirits and demons up on Thunder's drum. So they march their Warwick up there, and half of them get slaughtered by machines. When Aria vanished, I thought that Crazy might have gone with her. But no. Here's Big Aritok, gearing them up to do it all over again. What is it about the Banuk you can't make sense of? Hmm. Well, everything's a test to them. A hardship to endure. A challenge to survive. Seems like they don't have much of a choice in a place like this. Yeah. A land cold enough to crack teeth, filled with wild animals. You'd think they'd accept a little reasonably priced aid. Well, believe me, I've tried to convince them. But a Banuk with nothing left to prove might just lie down and die. And Orea is the one who spoke about this daemon? That's right. Told Aratak and the others that it lives up on Thunder's drum, and they believed him. But you don't. <laughs> Look, I don't know what Aurea found up there. A shaman's not going to talk to an outlander. The machines in the cut are getting more vicious, that's a fact. It could be because of the daemon, or it could be because they all got indigestion, for all I know. But Aurea's not around to explain. She took off, and no one knows why. Is Aratok a renowned warrior around here? He's a Warwick chieftain. His voice carries a lot of respect. Not that you hear much of it. Man talks about as much as a dead fish. But when he and Aurea came to town with their Warwick, it drew more Banuk to this little burg than I'd ever seen. Know what else I saw, Aloy? My own little trade route, stretching all the way back to the claim. Then, he goes and leads them off to their death at the claws of angry machines. Uh, so much for my best customers. Have you ever heard of a man named Silence? Tall, deadly serious, cables in his skin? Like a shaman? Hmm. I've heard that name once or twice, but always whispered. Like some boogeyman the Banuk want to forget. I'm not sure what went down, but I got the impression he messed with the Conclave. Or they messed with him. Conclave. All the most important shamans gather in Banur from time to time to keep up with the latest mumbo-jumbo. No idea how they all fit into one tent without those crazy headdresses getting locked up on each other. Aurea's been to that shindig, but when I asked her what it's like, she just gave me a dirty look. So if you want to know more, you'll have to find her and make her like you, I guess. <laughs> Good luck. What are these Werricks about, Burgrind? Some sort of tribe within the tribe? Eh, not like our clans back home. You don't get born into these things. They hold tryouts. Prove your best at something, and you might get a place. Some Werricks come and go. Some last as long as metal. The whole Banuk territory. Banur, hey, zombie boy, what's up? It's just a bunch up? of the biggest, oldest Werricks. I'm not sure if I'm less confused or more confused. <laughs> well, here's the sure thing. Each Warwick has a chieftain and a shaman. They make the decisions. All well and good, except the chieftains Happy are hard-headed. And the shamans have their heads in the clouds. You said you've lived out here for two winters? Aye. Back home, some fur traders told me about this steel-forsaken heap of tents. 
Good location. Ripe for change. We were barely scraping by until this place started filling up for Araya. A great prophet is coming, they said. Oh, I heard prophet. Honest mistake. Not that the Banook are stingy, they just prefer to keep trade among themselves. We could get through to enough of them. We could really put this place on the map. Or at least on a map. We? Me and my dog. Mm, my assistant, Barger. My assistant and my daughter. We seem to get along better as business partners. Her mother wanted me to show her a trade. She started tinkering with weapons. I say, when you need a break from this Banuke carry on, stop in and see her. You're both, uh. Mm, how do I put it? Uh, Women? No, 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 no. I independent. Look for her at Long Notch, the easternmost Banuke camp. I want to know more about this daemon. Mm -mm. It's crazy talk, Aloy. Or there's something to it. Something connected to how the machines behave. Then you need to find Aurea. She was last seen headed for the mountains they call the Ice Rests. <sighs> I've heard only the shamans know the trail beyond those frozen peaks. Mm. <laughs> but I do know where you could find her apprentice, Naltuk. Sounds like you he don't went north of the river, too much. chasing rumors. Rumors? Not the good kind. Sudden attacks in the snow. Strange new structures. Some say a new machine, like no one's seen before. Well, now I'm definitely interested. Thanks for the talk, Burgrind. Don't mention it. I wonder if Aratok could tell me more about the Rhea. My goodness, there is a. Shall we all die? Well, Yuri, hello. You seem sad, stranger. I heard you mention a flood. Yes, a sudden deluge, without like rain head. or melt to explain it. I'm Lao Lai, the drummer of Deep Din. Or at least I was, until it disappeared under the waters. Deep Din? What's that? A hollow, carved out by the old ones. A chamber, a basin, and a musical instrument all at once. My life, my calling. I'd explain it by playing for you if I could. But its pipes are deep under the water now. So Deep Din is a place, and a musical instrument? Yes. Pipes that carry a perfect tone beneath a sonorous basin. A wondrous edifice the old ones used to carry music far and wide. During the war, my father played the pipes to rally the Banuk against the Karja. I'm the drummer now. But our battles are few and far between. Mostly I play for the joy of it. Or to remember my family. Of course, if the waters don't recede, What's the point of joy? Or remembering? So the waters came fast. One day it was dry. The next, the nearby river had risen and the entire basin was flooded. I don't understand it. There was no rain, not even any clouds, and yet the river rose higher than I'd ever seen it. Oh no. And there it remains. A flood without rain. That is strange. Where is this place? I'll have a look if I'm in the area. Just northwest of here. Look all you like, but I don't see what good it'll do. The floodwaters aren't going anywhere. How does one ask a river to relent? You beat it into them. Deep in. Good night, Gaddis. Thanks for coming in and hanging out for a little bit. Hope you have a good week. Interesting new weapons. Very rare. Are these better? I have to go find other things to pick them. Oh, look, there's more. Oh my goodness, look at that outfit. There's <laughs> 30% extra hiding. It's the mask. Clearly. No, you can't buy them with the necessary. I, what? Oh, because I need desert glass and sunshine. Or whatever. <laughs> okay, fine. Oh, there's an 
another new quest. Oh wait, is that like right here? No more music. I do not want to hear this talk from you again. Doubt is heavier than a week's snow. Forgive me, my chieftain. We will be ready for the next attempt. But this will not be an attempt. It must be done. Do you understand? My chieftain. Good. Outlander, I suppose you wish to speak? Aurea knows about this, Damon. Where would I talk to her? She does a shaman's work. That is not for the eyes and ears of others. Certainly not in Outlanders. This Damon you talked about. If you are hardy enough, you can venture out and see the signs yourself. It has changed the machines, made them fiercer, stronger. But what is it? A matter for the shamans to debate. Did your Warwick come from this place? No, he rallied most of our hunters from across Banyur. To face the threat of the demon. But I was born here and stayed to fight the Karja when others retreated into the mountains. A few of my old warriors remain with me, those who survived. There are other Werax in Song's Edge, too? Yes. The village has its own life for all Banuku need trade or shelter. After the war ended, it sprang up from what was once a campsite, quick as the bloom between frosts. Perhaps it will last until the Karja seek war again. You're set on going back to the mountain? I have put my word to it. Even with the risks being so great? The risk of what? Death? It would be a worse fate to bow our heads to the challenge and say too much. Well, I guess that's it then. Good. I prefer deeds to words. Right. Going to the lake. I want to learn more about how this flame oh, affects hello. the machines. Got to find Maria. To do that, I need to talk to her apprentice. Outland. Wait. The river wait a moment. What about this hat, Ruth? That weapon of yours, Outlander. That spear. I can see the blue light upon it. This? It was made by an acquaintance of mine. Ah. Uh, a shaman? Uh, no. More of a tinker? A tinker does not understand the spark in the metal, the song in the metal like this. But it could be improved upon, modified with the help of the old ones. Far north of here, there is a cave, a shaft Wait, is he gonna give me a better Within spear? Within it is a nest of metal birds. Find a bird that hasn't been stripped by shaman's past, Look for a rail inside it, the length of your spear. That's all I can tell you. Get a rail from some metal birds in a cave. Sounds perfectly normal. Clearly this man does not need peripheral vision. Find the rail part. We're gonna go freaking that one because uh, a stronger weapon can be used in everything. I'm sorry to our friend who wants us to figure out the lake, but she can wait for us to get a stronger weapon. <laughs> so I die less. Any news from the hunt? The herd isn't roaming far from the camp. Oh my gosh. Sorry. Wait, but I bet we'll see a strike. All right, I'll keep watching. I don't know what happened. That badger just fainted. Whoa. Nutritious. Show of hands. Who would eat badger nuggets? Who are you? Outlanders. Gorge Outlanders. Said the said the is of the north of the river. <laughs> not so far. Oh, 
I don't know what just happened. Guys, did you see that? That goat just keeled over. <laughs> so weird. There must be no Took. Bro, did you see? Oh my god. What the frick? Or signal. Hey guys. What is that? Interesting. Control Maybe I could override it. So far away. No. Shields are reloaded by that pulse from the tower. What if I shoot it with an exploding? That didn't do anything. But get the attention of. Things I don't want the attention of. Here they come. I should probably try to get slightly closer. Let's see where you There's a machine. Well. Come here, buddy. I can't use Oh my god. Okay. They're heading back. Good night, Mike. Good luck. fighting these things. I don't need to fight them. <laughs> I just got a little distracted. It's fine. Not even. I don't even know what that's related to. There's the log. We'll get, we'll get into exploring that area later. We're getting the stronger spear. Don't let me get distracted. <laughs> I sure hope that goat doesn't randomly pass out. That would be a shame. Like a dying... Really? I see a 
this snow person. They are. run away from those creatures. Colorado. What is that? I could not for the life of me guess. There. That must be where the water's coming from. Looks like something the old one has built. I'm sorry, I will take you the most literally that I could ever take anybody. Uh, I think that goat just threatened me. Oh wait, this is Earth. Are you talking about like a legitimate place? Because this is just like a killed Earth. <laughs> this is a legitimate place. Oh no. It's very famous. Oh no. I say that because I am a nap. Single friend. Keen is rock. Oh, I have not seen any pictures of Yellowstone. <laughs> I couldn't tell you what Yellowstone looks like in regular conditions. That's really cool. Okay, boy. Now what? It's 
It's in the lore. Oh my gosh, this snow is just sticking to our outfit. You know how cold that is? I remember... It would have gone unnoticed, but I appreciate knowing that. I told you, I'm just inept. But also... I mean, in general, I enjoy knowing that. I was gonna say, what was I gonna Must say? I Shaman told me about. remember in Alaska down, when it was so cold, and I'm sure it's either. in other places. I know it is, because it sucks. Being so cold outside that you breathe, and like your breath is wet enough that it touches your hair and then starts freezing your hair. You won't be alone down here. Well. And I can tell you, I do not miss that. Here's one of the metal birds. <laughs> Probably going to need Have you ever been to Yellowstone, Monty? Bruh, please, fill in with all of the random things. I want to know. I have random Jeffrey Dahmer facts, okay? This is probably way more helpful. Let's be real. Ugh. I have the facts about Jeff that make me a weirdo. Just have to go up. machine over a little. That what machine? <laughs> we all got weird brains. We just have different obsessions. It's fine. I accept. <laughs> Everybody in their uniqueness, please. Not so grounded after all. Now I can get across. There is the door lock. I'll need to configure it. Uh-huh, your brain is normal. Oops. Uh-oh. Good luck, Monty. You know, I don't think I've actually watched anything about Yellowstone, like, ever. Got too much already. already she says i think we can carry more i mean i think that you were actually officially voted as the most normal person on the server like no at some point while you were gone because somebody i think grumble asked the egal and he was like mm, i'm not and then you got voted hey well that's good the way out. My bad. Still, more good good luck with the conversation. Hey, Yandy, what's up? Okay, let's try this again. And not jump the opposite way out. Hopefully, maybe. How's it going? Happy Easter. Uh. 
My focus might see something here. Mounting rail. That's what I want. Hello. Shouldn't be hard to remove. I'll show it to that shaman when I'm back in Song's Edge. That's fair. Sprinting quietly. It's time. So I passed that. Spare, huh? You won the most. You love that you won the most normal. Yep. You can even check with the server. I kept sending you money requests. Oh, no. you wanna? <laughs> you wanna invest in some Bitcoin, oh, buddy? Oh. Is this what you hush, hush. what about premium the NFTs Shaman's that are so are special that you ha you can't even see them like this it's an invisible to NFT find it. Find it to, to make sure spear. that other people Use can't it to steal attach it. this for now you'll find more I'm sure why are you helping me the blue light is fading the machine songs are ending and and what does the conclave do they sit they chant they observe no more we must fight for it and you you are a fighter we share a cause. I'm not sure we do. I'm not even sure what the cause is. But I'm grateful. No need for thanks. Only action. Now I can attach modification parts to my spear. Well, get started improving my spear. Heck yeah. I can feel that. There's only so much. There is nothing better. Just know. It's why... <laughs> I just think it's been like... A year and a half. A little over a year and a half. And we got the Easties and the Easties Mission and this the Aliens last. and the Westies and the 
Westies pretty cool. And then somehow Scarlet and Marky perfectly match Casey and Ralph. Game a year and a half. The Southwesties and the Northeasties. That poor goat. What just happened? That's crazy. All my money. I don't know when I got eighteen thousand. That poor squirrel. I don't know what just happened. takes place in Oregon. If this is, is that where Yellowstone is? Guys, please. Oh, somebody wanted in. Don't make fun of me. They blew this entire ledge off just to get through the door. <laughs> is it Wyoming? Planning detected. Evacuation recommended. Overflow basin compromised. The overflow basin. Is that the den? Ah, oh, Montana, yes. I'm like, it's on the northern states. I just don't know if it like crosses states because you got what, like Oregon and Montana and then North Car North Dakota. I did not say North Carolina. North Dakota. <laughs> You know, yesterday on the street, I saw a North Carolina and a South Carolina license plate right next to each Looks other. Looks like a control center. What happened in here to start the water flowing? Oh my gosh, there's a person. And there's our troublemaker. Doesn't seem to be as good at getting out as he is at getting in. Idaho. Okay, it's Idaho. Oregon is underneath. Idaho is up here. Look, I lived on southeastern Washington, and it was, like, in both directions. Another holographic interface. The lock positions. Helpful. Let's go find another power cell.
That Osaron must have forced his way through here. just made me. <laughs> For a moment, I thought my fire was snuffed. The forge gone cold. But nope. Nope. Not old Gildan. You're... welcome? Uh, wait. Start from the beginning. What are you doing down here? Ow! My apologies. <laughs> When you mostly talk to yourself, you can tell your stories in whatever order you like. There's an artifact in that storage room I simply must acquire. But as you may have noticed, the door won't budge. You do have a great hat. I took I one of those roundish, ringy what's-its from the wall beside the door. No luck. So I had to go with that panel. Oh, he had the, the power button. cell. Even less luck. My gentle experimentation caused the chamber to... Flood. So I push the button again, perhaps a little too enthusiastically. Sparks and smoke. <laughs> now, obviously, I came here to investigate. My cautious footsteps may have contributed slightly to the collapse of a bridge. And when the bridge began to collapse, I may have, for the sake of expedience, abandoned the cumbersome ringy what's it to the waves. By the time I thought to give up the endeavor, the door had closed behind me. And thusly do we come to the present moment. You said something about an artifact? Indeed. That storage room is brimming with treasures from the old ones. But one in particular caught my eye. An intricate looking glass. I've only seen one such device before. My old mom brought one back for me from... Wherever she'd gone to that time, I remember holding it, staring into its face, seeing myself and my mother just over my shoulder, smiling. And one of these looking glasses, it's in the storage room. Oh, yes, I'm quite sure. I peered into that dim little chamber and there it was. I've wanted to find one for so long, I... Yes, this time I'm sure I have. Well, there's no way we're getting into that storage room without another hey, ring. Hey, Xenomorph, what's up? The locking mechanism that controls the door. You don't say. Well, that's fantastic news. Marvelous, even. You've got two hands. I've got two hands. Perfect. <laughs> my savior, my salvation, and if you like, why wouldn't you? Of course you will. My accomplice. <laughs> Together, that ring is as good as ours, and with it, the storage room and its spoils. Didn't you say you dropped the ring in the water? Well, I'll grant you that adds a heretofore undiscussed level of complexity to the proceedings. So you found the button that controls the flow of water. <laughs> quite by accident. And then you broke that button. Also, quite by accident. This is the DLC. The panel's the only way to shut this place down, as far as I can tell. <laughs> this isn't gonna be easy. That storage room is filled, top to bottom. Would you be surprised to find the parts you need in there? I certainly wouldn't be. So, we need to replace that ring and get into the storage room. Then I can fix the panel and shut this place down. And I can finally wrap my fingers around that looking glass. Okay, Gildan. How are we gonna get that ring? Two sets of hands, girl! Two sets of hands! Behind us lie a pair of enormous gates, but I believe the gates must be operated in tandem. Together, we can dry this place out. Guess we better get started, then. I guess we better. Up ahead, girl. See the valve? Time to put our hands to use. I'll take care of this one. There's another valve on the other side to lock the gate in place. Would you mind heading across and uh, oh, doing gonna the make, honors? It's gonna make me get to the hard one. Is that how this is gonna go? You know, I'm reminded 
of a dell by under jerk out near the claim. <sighs> I love stagnant water. Charming. Does he know I can't hear him also? Welcome. And wasn't, uh, Sam, wasn't the Strauss and Monty thing in... It was like the Devil's... The Devil's Key? Whatever it was called. Down there closer to Nevada. Why would the old... Marvelous! You made it! Now grab that valve and give it a spin! Honest. A little more now, and I should be able to get the blasted thing moving. Devil's Tower. There. You should be able to lower the gate. I was like, devil is in the name. That's the show. You are. Now, when I get this gate down, you'll need to turn the valve again. On a lock this thing in place. Oh my gosh. Thank you. My, please don't make fun of me for my job. I look at Atlas and Skura so much. One gate down. Lost. Halfway through then, right. aren't we? To the right. second gate. I'm dumb, okay. <laughs> uh, it wouldn't be in Nevada, because he picked up the place in first. You're right. A ladder is a rare and special I just remember thing, I've seen girl. it recently, and I think I thought recently because I was looking at Wyoming. And no further. Other reasons. Hmm. I'd wager the valves for the second sluice gate are somewhere above us. How are we gonna get up there? Let me look around, see what I can find. Looks like I could jump across on that rickety western platform. Oh! Nice jump! Look, let's be. <laughs> nice! What am I saying? That was stupendous! Okay, let's be real. They don't teach such about absolute this. disregard for Certain personal things safety. when you're studying. Thanks, I think. Oh. But thank you, Monty. And thank you for not making fun of me for being dumb. Ready? One, two, three, four! Caught sell out and run away, Cal! Oh, no, it's Sierra! Okay. I forgot the words. Yeah. Now we've done this once before. Should be as easy as falling down a hole. If you take the valve on the other side. Let's set up the same way on this side. I should you went there? Is time. it cool? Cafe in Baltimore. and turn the valve. Let's 
I only sometimes. I own only sometimes. Oh, oh no! Is he ever afraid that his foam Stonehenge is going to like blow away in the wind? I can't jump straight to the cataract from here. I could climb higher, but I don't want to. After I've killed it, also probably depends on the dam because uh, falling off Niagara Falls. I cannot believe some people sign up to get in a barrel and fall off of Niagara. You were right. This thing did swallow the ring. <laughs> That's the old gilded intuition in action. Never led me astray. Sure, its chosen roots can be a bit circuitous, but never mind. To the storage room. To the spoils. Oh, what's in here? More old world treasures, perhaps? This place is full of surprises. Should we have a look? Thanks for stopping in. Uh-oh. Oh. oh, 
I see. Ish. You got a competent mind, girl. A mind for nuance and finesse. Not I. No, indeed. Not old Gildan. Oh. Bye, Ruth. Thanks for hanging out. I'm not, That's not quite right. Entirely sure where we are trying to send this. Looks like I'm on the right track. Something's not right. There. One step closer. I don't think we're one step closer, Aloy. Hmm. That wants us to turn it again. We got this going over here. This job demands a certain degree of patience. I'm afraid I inherited my mother's restlessness. Uh, getting there. Flowing, just where it needs to. Been at this a while, girl. No room to judge, mine. I won't spend half a day flummoxed by a carja puzzle box. <laughs> Smells like a forge side morning in a claim. See? Check this out. We could just bang on this pipe, you know? It... Could we sample that or totally? Like what about a Good night, Superman. I can speak. So, then there was just you and me. You know, is it cold in, uh, is it cold where you are right now? You 
always been. I can't believe that worked. I thought you'd lost your mind tickling the empty air like that. Guess that means you can't see them. I mean, this is it. We get to play together, what? Maybe two more times? Nah, sure. Farewell tour! I saw one in here. That just means I can harass you. Can't have imagined it. One doesn't imagine such things. Not two delves in a row. I mean, I can only understand that because I would miss you if I didn't have you, but... Golden? Everything okay? I was so sure I saw it. The looking glass. I was so sure. Right there in the window. I would... Of course. Trick of the light. Nothing at all. I'm sorry, Gildan. It must have meant a lot to you. Oh, well... Much as any artifact of the old ones would mean to me, really. It's fine. Uh, I'm fine. Besides, what are the spoils compared to the Delve? That's why we do it, girl. <laughs> the Delve, not the treasure. <laughs> and what a Delve it was! Uh, by the Great Blazing Forge, I'll never forget that. Now then, I uh, believe we have some repairs to make. Prettier, isn't it? <laughs> what does it mean? It means it worked. By the forge. <laughs> you are a wonder! And bro. Do you hear that often? I'll hazard a guess you do. I've heard something like that once or twice. <laughs> oh, she's modest now. A master of the arts of the old ones, a delver to shame the entire claim, and she wants to be modest. <laughs> it's not like I did it alone, Gildan. No. No, I suppose not. So what's next for you? On your way back to the claim? And deprive the people of Song's Edge the story of this encounter? Perish the thought! <laughs> I'll stay there a while longer. But a story is best told by all who encountered it. Come and lend a hand, won't you? Overflow basin empty. Interior accessible. Minimal flood damage. Okay. Sounds like she the basin's like right too. Pleasantly yeah, surprised. Another adventure so soon? <laughs> Braver than me. Ah, there was no question of that. <laughs>
against her. You warned us. You warned us. She wasn't kidding about the sound. I was like, are they friendly? And no, they are not. Set them on fire. Oh, okay.
made a mistake. I can understand that feeling. <sighs> Feels like if I blink, my eyes will freeze shut. Because I also feel like, from what you said before, you've been used like that. In general. By a lot of people. I don't know what you did, but the water drained in the snap of a short song. What do you think of the music? I've never heard anything else like it. That's because there's no other place with such resonance, such intonation that rattles your ribs with its power. And of course, no one else knows these pipes like I do. I learned them by ear before I could walk, strapped to my father's back. Thank you for draining the waters. Not just for myself but for my ancestors and their songs. Please, take this as a token of our gratitude. gonna kill me for happy for helping her with that. Oh good, you can't hear it anymore out here. Neltuk? Who are you? How did you find me? Burgrind told me you'd be out here. He's persistent. I've told that Asaram a thousand times. I don't need to buy anything. And I'm not selling. I just need to find Araya. Well, you won't. She's gone where only shamans can tread. Mm. She seeks guidance from the voice in the blue light. 
That is her task. And the task she gave me is to observe the daemon's work. To stop it spreading, if I can. But what can I do about these towers? In only a few weeks, they've sprouted throughout the cut. The daemon's energy pulses from them. Rallies the machines, even repairs them. Aratok said this daemon was... frenzying machines? Look there. Those with the purple markings. They belong to the daemon. They're stronger, more dangerous. I've seen something like this before. A corruption. But it wasn't from your daemon. You have? Well, then you know more than I do. These towers, were they part of your corruption? No. Those are new to me, too. Like I said, they empower the daemon's machines. They must be stopped. Will you tell me where Aurea went? You ask a lot of questions. Only when I'm not getting the answers I need. There's but one voice Aurea wants to hear right now, and it isn't yours. I'm sorry. All right. You want to stop the spread of the Daemon's work? I know how to get started. With my bow and spear. Outlander, wait. Won't you tell me your name? Aloy. Good. If you fall to the Daemon's machines, at least I can properly recount your efforts to Aurea. Thanks for the vote of confidence. But I won't fall. And when I'm done, you're gonna tell me where she is. I already dealt with the tower and the machine. Now we know how to deal with the machines and the towers. The daemon's next. Perhaps Aurea should meet you after all. But what she truly seeks is hope. After what I just saw, you could show her that. She's in retreat beyond those mountains, the ice rasps. You'll have to walk the shaman's path to get there. You'll know you've reached the end when you come to a shrine. A great machine covered in blue gleam. Shamans who That's complete fair. the path take a piece of it as reward. If you make it that far. Are they screaming? You I'm should assuming too. screaming for not. Door. You'll have earned it. You said something about blue gleam at the end of the shaman's path? A crystal that builds on the bodies of machines in the oldest ice. We Banuk believe it's the stuff of the blue light, frozen as it escapes their shells. You might be more interested that merchants will trade well for it. Bergen told me you're Aurea's apprentice. In her absence, I serve the chieftain and his Werak as an advisor, a scout, a speaker for the blue light. A lot of responsibilities. I don't know if I can live up to Aurea's example, but I have to try. I owe her that much. She took a chance on me, an aspiring shaman from the edge of the world. No one else would. Were you with Aurea when they attacked the mountain? I wish I had been, even with all that happened. I'm no warrior, though. So she bid me wait. When Aurea and the chieftain returned, I saw them argue bitterly. I don't know what about exactly. Then she came to me, gave me my task, and left us. How do I cross this shaman's path? Go to the ice rasps. Then follow the markers through the ice caves and the waterfalls, and make the climb to the shrine. But be careful. The path is meant to be an ordeal, the final trial of a young shaman's training. And I'll find Aurea at the end of it? No. She goes further up, somewhere inside the mountain. 
If you see her, would you tell her? I have faith she will hear the voice again. We got this. Oh no, we have to climb up the whole mountain. You know, I know he just said that, but also. The shaman's path begins somewhere up above. Hey, buddy. Hey, buddy, McGuy, give me some uh, potions. It can be hard to tell, especially with like play streaming. Cause I mean, when I was a kid, we had this game called Bloody Murder, where you would hide in the cul-de-sac area, like not far, cause you had to be able to see the house. And uh, then somebody would come looking for everybody who was hiding. And as soon as the person who found <laughs> the person who was it found someone, the child would scream, and then we all ran for base. with bloody murder. It's almost like hide and seek meets tag because you would hide somewhere. Murder in the park? No, well if you could describe it, maybe. What is murder in the park? Between my teeth. I just say, how do you play? Oh, oh my gosh, did you play the? Did you play the free tag, but it was toilet tag? in the dark and someone I'm is the murderer. Up. The shaman's path must if be right the there somewhere. Standing, this must be one of the markers the Natuk told me about. Sounds like a variation of uh, bloody murder. <laughs> Poor Q. So it's like freeze tag, except when you're tagged and you're frozen. And you scream. See, I feel like murder in the, par in murder in the dark and bloody murder are about the same game. Toilet tag. It is freeze tag, but when you get tagged, you get down on one knee, and then you put your hand out, like so. And so then to unfreeze you, somebody has to sit on your knee and or... I can't remember if you have to sit on the knee. Actually, I don't think you sit on the knee. I think they just have to flush. So then whoever has to run by and just push your plunger down, and then you can get up. Because they gotta flush the toilet. They may have Long had way. to sit on your knee and then flush. I don't remember.
say, it sounds pretty familiar. So then, yes, Monty. What am I doing? I don't know, it says to activate this. But I'm not entirely sure what it wants me to do. Looks like each marker points to another, giving directions. Chime for to help guide the way with sound. If there's more, maybe my focus can find them. We are now back. Took a wrong turn. I grab this loot. After you're done looting. You know how it goes, Aloy. A family stream that loots together gets rich together. Looter family, yep. Yep, focus can pick up the charms. Should help me find my way. Like, I bet you have fun. Mm. <laughs> oh, I see something up there. Houses. Horses. Carriages. Another marker. Good. Is the best move. Not this way. The 
love that you found along the way. think that they could take advantage of her. Testing our shaman abilities. Stalkers. Better be careful. Okay. From here. You know, I face that a lot. <laughs> it is what it is. What if I gonna sneak up on me. Did you see that? Thank you, mirror armor. <sighs> Toasty! Especially if she acting dumb, they would. Out of this cave. But you know what? Thank you for just making it easier to uh, loot you. 
you do got a fan. I think you got yourself a fan. Fan behavior. You're a fan. Done with the cave. So what's next on this path? I can sometimes accomplish things. You know, it only pity stinky here because there's so many stinkies. Oh no. I need to pull the rope to move this thing into position. Okay, the bridge is for me. Been here for ages with me and spirit. The air. Me. No wonder I'm seeing so much. Save yourself, Aloy. Oh my god. That cold. Is that a bear? There's definitely something new out here. A bear robot? But I don't think it's friendly.
I'm not watching where that bear is right now. It's fine. did just diss me. He just picked me up off the ground, threw me, held me in a bear hug, thought that he was gonna get away with it. think they're gonna get away with it, but they ain't. Uh. <laughs> well, you know, I struggle for like the first two to three weeks. It's happened every time I've started a new Yakuza game too. I struggle so bad. Get ready for me to struggle with no more heroes until I don't. Got pages of those? Lucy has arms, so I'm pretty sure she bearing them. Shrine Naltuk was talking about. I guess I should take some blue gleam. That's what was saying. See why it's worth a lot. <laughs> I got you, homie. Naltuk said the rail went past the shrine into the mountain. I'd better take those stairs. Hmm. 
play. Bob just tried to roll out a low and then got a critical Green failure. It makes me think of the one Maybe time. Is inside. That I listened to my boss at one of my old jobs talk about his D&D group and how his dwarf <sighs> character tried to get into a fight with a skeleton and the rolling ended up that, uh... When his hands got near that guy, it was not a punch. That's, uh, what I should probably... Lots of strange equipment. What was this place? Yeah, how dare you, Bob. Monty deserves better. Times 20. This is Director of Security Blevins resending the emergency supply order. Try reading it this time, okay? You sh weasels don't want me calling my people in SLC. You do be a delicate flower and the rarest flowers. Director of Security Blevins is writing us like a petty tyrant. I can't even sneeze without triggering his control issues. Those nodes on the floor must be connected to the door. Yay! I'm glad that you're feeling better. Something. What am I supposed to do with these lights? Oh my gosh, what am I supposed to do with these lights? It's time to be big brain. <laughs> This is why I can't play horror games, okay? They're like, horror games are like, let us this make you turn. be Changing smart. The uh, the truth. I'm glad it can't help, and I'm always glad to have you here. <laughs> you and Bob are both taxes! taking German and my German teacher who was my German one teacher was from actual Germany and my German two teacher was actually Greek and she spoke five languages but German one teacher was like so it's spelled B-O-O-T but it's pronounced Das Boot do not say Das Boot <laughs> that's all I ever remember Maybe I can get back inside through that structure over there. Looks like I need to get to those stairs. Like, I know the two most important German phrases. And they're like the only ones that I think of first. Char, what's Max do? 
or Basmak and Z, depending on how formal you want to be. And Kaina Ono. Which is just, what are you doing? And <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> no idea. Hey, Kennedy. Dying. Oh no, what is the gender of that word? Boss is dying. Leapsling essence. Someone hacked the menu board to display obscene messages about our colleague, Mr. Blevins. Is this the most advanced geological project ever undertaken, or a junior high locker room? Come on, people. The uh, frick does Flussfeld mean? I got a used version of my German 1 book, by the way, because it was way cheaper, obviously, since it was a college textbook. Of course, you know what's written in the margins? Swear words. Of course swear words were written into the margins. It's like over here. Thicken. Thank you, buddy. In chapter one. Plus, you know, fair, fair is horse. So, oh my gosh. Plus, plus is river. So, plus fair is a river again, horse. As I've asked a thousand <laughs> times. Speak to me. What more would you have me do? Is there no prayer that will reach you? No mark that will break your bonds? Ah. <laughs> I can't help you if you won't legit. speak! A whisper is all I ask. To guide me. You know what I haven't learned? Any Jeff. Who? <laughs> Swear words. No. How? How did you get here? The way was sealed by the spirit herself. I... I used one of these. Nick, if you want to say that word in, in Italian, show you. Monty yes, is married. Show me. So now you can say it in three languages. Please. I figure it's mostly just being rude. From what I've seen, it is just being more abrasive is the way that... <laughs> I think I saw somebody on Twitter, not Twitter, on Instagram that had like, here are some basically phrases that'll piss people off. <laughs> that are pretty much equal to swearing, but they're not. And they were just being rude. Kenny and I don't need to fight about the laundry, so instead we fight about incommensurability and restrictions on machine intelligence. Yep. But I'll bet the goal's the same. Oh no. Light back to the source. Where is the light currently? Where are you? Where you be light? Uh, where is the light coming from? Is this where the light? No. Okay, so the light source is this center guy. I thought the light, that was where...
I don't even know where this light source is coming. Wait, it means back to the center? is a blade. Don't worry, I'm doing an AI update later this week. There's more good stuff. More good stuff to think about. Also ruined sleep. You and I, Toasty, we can be the sleep to the sleep is ruined party. We just uh, sending that right back in there. Thank you very much. It does not want to exist in that. I'm glad that it helped. I freaking love my weighted blanket, so I am glad that it has benefited you. plug in right there so this is the one that it has to come out of so this is gonna probably go that way it's surprising probably overheat away in a way is like I this and then it's like boom boom oh <laughs> no appreciate this. Look, I have to be using my brain, okay? This is a not chill. I think 
we I think we're getting somewhere. Heck yeah. Auxiliary channel recovered. Exploit successful. Restraints available. Best, best cake. One of the best cake. Is what someone there? Ick Orea? A lot of cake. Orea, I need you. Return to schedule task. No, I will not submit. Orea, the daemon is forcing me. Orea, Walla 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 You heard it. That's how you know. The voice of the spirit calling to me from the heights of Thunder's Drum. She was able to throw off the bonds of the daemon for a moment. Because of what you did. Who are you? The chosen one. I am the what main character. Want? I'm Aloy. Naltuk sent me. He thought that you could use my help. He was not mistaken. You've been a... revelation. Now I know for certain that the spirit endures. Perhaps together we can find a way to set her free. Let's not get ahead of ourselves. I came all this way for answers, and so far, I haven't heard any. It seems to me that you are the answer. But of course, I'll tell you all I can. Bergren said you might know something about a man named Silence. That you may have had dealings with him at the Conclave? When that name is spoken, secrets soon follow, or vanish, as the case may be. Why do you want to know? He's done some terrible things. But he's also helped me when no one else could. I don't know as much about him as I'd like to. I would imagine his aid is very powerful. But it will not come without cost. Unfortunately, I am sworn to an oath of secrecy by the Conclave on this matter. I get that. But you and I are trying to help each other, right? Yes. But I would be breaking an oath, and that... I cannot do. I was so confused for a second when you guys were saying Damon, Bib. I was like, what, what do you is know about Bib? it? I spoke <laughs> with the spirit Bib. many times. First here, Bob. then inside Thunder's Drum. The last time. She told me she was under attack by something that could not be seen by mortal eyes. Something evil. I don't abuse Bob in my she book. Named there it are two Bobs. And said Bob it needed her Bob power Arnold. to do what it willed. And she begged me for help. To find a way to destroy her, if necessary, to keep it from using her. That was five years ago. I didn't hear her voice again. Until today. What kept you from the spirit, after it begged for help? I went to Artok, hoping he could protect her. But the war with the Karja still raged, and before I could reach him... I was ambushed by the Mad Sun King's Kestrels, and taken to Meridian in chains. I wasn't able to return to Thunder's Drum until long after the liberation, not until last thaw. You said you returned to Thunder's Drum. That was... The expedition that went bad. I saw the funeral. <laughs> yes. Once there was finally peace with the Karja, Aratak and I gathered a warrock of great hunters to defeat the daemon. And yet, the old door to Thunder's Drum was gone, replaced by a gate we could not pass, and many machines. We were crushed. Aratok called a retreat, but we had already lost our best. We abandoned them to the snow as we fell back. After. You and I could not agree on what to do next. So I came here, hoping against hope to hear the spirit again. And because of you, I did. You seem to have a history with this voice, this 
Spirit. She saved my life. Here, years ago, during the war with the Karja. A raid scattered my Werak. I was cut off, alone. I lured the enemy into the Rhyme Drifts, hoping to lose them in the mist, but they endured, so... I took refuge in this cave. That's when I heard her voice. A wanderer. Lost, like me. A spirit of the blue light yet sundered from it. She asked me for aid. She chose me. But I was in no position to help, not with the Karja after me. So she helped me first. By closing a door on the mountain below, one you must have opened to get here. Locked by means similar to those found in this room. It kept the Karja from reaching me. Safe from them. I was able to do as she asked. What did the spirit want from you? She said she was... hurt. Incomplete. She needed bones. Parts not unlike what you'd find in a machine. They were here, in this room. She wanted me to bring them to Thunder's Drum. So I did, and she showed me how to heal her. So began our communion. You had a communion with the spirit? Yes. She's talking to Alexa. Inside Thunder's Drum is a room like this one, only larger, with an altar. I went there many times to speak with her. What did she say? She told me she was lost and needed my help. She asked questions about our lands, our tribe, and she listened with patience, with wisdom. I told her things long kept silent about my family, my dreams, my fears. She never tired of me, never judged. We kept each other's company. Aurea, what do you think the spirit is? I see. You are not Banuk, and our songs are not familiar to you. You do not know of the blue light. That which struggles to survive in our hearts and animates the machines. The essence of life, and in its purest form. Harmony. As the anger of the machines grows, this light has faded from the world. And the spirits it sustains are stranded. That's what she is. A lost soul. Cut off from what it needs. Lonely, forsaken. I must help her. We must. I'm not sure if I understand. But I want to. That's all I need. About silence? I've told you all I can. There's nothing more I can say. Let's see if I've got this straight. We heard two voices. One you call the spirit. Captured somehow by the one you call a daemon. Whatever this daemon is, it's related to the machines and why they've become more dangerous. I want to know how. Both the spirit and the daemon are on a mountain. Thunder's drum. So why don't we go there and figure out what it all means? We can't. Thunder's drum is dangerous more than you can imagine. The daemon has secured it. Do I not look like a main Besides, character to you? We're good. Our talk won't let us go. It's legit. As chieftain, he controls the pass to the mountain. And he can't be reasoned with. Sounds like you need a new chieftain. Huh. There's an idea that's certain to win us friends. Huh. You said you were a hunter. And I'll wager you're not an ordinary one. It's not impossible. Even for an outlander. An Aratok couldn't refuse the challenge if you were known among the Werak. <laughs> Wait, uh... Me? Challenge Aratok? I don't want to be chieftain of anything, much less a bunch of Banuk that don't want me. But you want to go to Thunder's Drum, don't you? You heard the spirit. She's suffering, tormented by the daemon. She longs to be free. And perhaps, when released from her bonds, she can give you the answers you well, seek. Well, it seems like a lot to get some I'm answers. Fine. What do I have to do? Get the Werak's attention to show the worth of your claim. Win at the hunting grounds. Kill bandits that prey on the cut. Or speak to my friend, Sekuli. You help her, you'll definitely get noticed. Is there a tall neck in the area? Yes, near the frost figures. But 
It's been frozen in ice for generations. What does that have to do with anything? It'll help, trust me. Maybe even more than I thought. <sighs> if you say so. Do all you can. When the time comes for you to throw your spear at Aritok's feet, I will be there to back your claim. Until then, I'll be here to answer any questions you have about the challenge. Oh, and one more thing. In the box over there is a weapon, like my own. Take it. You may find it useful. Like, what did I just get? A weapon in the box. Hey, what now? Bob. Indeed. There are a lot of bobs. You got a thingy ma bob now. You got a bippity bobbity boo. Thing of a bob. Floaty bob. Bob, Doodle Bob, heck yeah, I am. I'm gonna OP the heck out of it. Like, what else do I need? Disarm trap so you can use it. Increases the chance of bones, lenses, and hearts, and skins. Well, you know, maybe I should have done that a while ago. A launching jump repair speed, you know? You can see the smoking mountain. Okay, one second. I'll do this one so that I, I don't think I'll need... Bees, but... Breeze through the trees. <laughs> oh, is it that one? It's a bloaty. That looks cool. <laughs> I was like, I hope this works. Bear. Oh my gosh! 
Excuse me! Wait, do I have to do each of these little ones? Complete the trial on the hunting ground. Do I have to do all these little tiny ones? We were out that bandit camp, so I should start with this one over here. Which is way up there. Did I just destroy my opportunities on this? Oh, I can do only two of them? That's good. That's good to know. Because I don't want to do the hunt. I don't want to do the, uh, the hunting trial. I'm okay without that. Clear, I'll do the bandit camp, that's for sure. I like fixing tall boys. I like tall boys. Oh. Hunt's over here, fights on. I come in peace! Zigzag. She is making haste in this snow. Snow is not the easiest thing to run in. Together. Let's go, buddy. Didn't startle me at all, it's fine. <laughs> Very good. Oh my god. The flower tree sent her down? Oh, the flower. Oh, okay, I got you. We are going to save and pick up this next time. We came across Old Faithful just a second ago. This is a good time to stop. So. Proving ourselves to the Warwick next time. Be prepared. Who knows what else will happen. But we will prove. Thank you, everybody, for hanging out. Hope you have a good night. Hope you had a good night. And I will see you next time. Don't die. <laughs>